All right, so here we're going to look at two more examples of multiplying. And these examples will have to carry um, some digits to the next column. So in part A here, we have 677 uh, multiplied by 8. So the first thing I'm going to do is 8 times 7. Well, 8 times 7 is going to give us 56. And we just keep the rightmost digit, which is going to be a 6. And then the leftmost digit, that's what we carry to the next column. So I'm going to put a, a 5 there. And again, that makes sense, right? Um, you would want to carry the, the 5 that's in the tens place to the tens column. So that's what we're doing. Well, now what we do is we do 8 times 7. Again, I'm just going to multiply. Again, well, we just said, hey, that's 56. And then what we do is we add that, you know, kind of uh, extra stuff that we carried over. So 56 plus 5 is going to give us 61. Okay, so 56 plus 5. So you can think about there's being a little plus in there. And again, we just carry, uh, we keep the rightmost digit, and then we carry the left digit. So I'm going to keep the 1, and then I'm going to carry the 6 to the next place. So let's see, 8 times 6 is going to give us 48. And then again, we just add 6 to that, and that's going to give us 54. And we've kind of multiplied now by all of the digits, so we just drop that down, uh, 54. So it says if you take 677 and multiply that by 8, you'll get 5,416. Okay, so let's do another example, uh, same idea. So 294 times 6, okay, well, 6 times 4, I'm just multiplying there. That's going to give us 24. Again, we keep the rightmost digit in the same column, which is a 4. And we'll carry the 2 to the next column. Well, let's see. We'll do 6 times 9. 6 times 9 is 54. And then the same thing. We just add that uh, value that we carried, which is a 2. So that's going to give us 56. Again, we keep that rightmost digit in the same column, the 6. We'll carry the 5 to the next column. And then one last time. So we'll do 6 times 2. 6 times 2 is going to give us 12. And then we add on 5, which is going to give us 17. And that's the number we just dropped down. So it says 294 times 6 is 1,764.